Yeah, you can understand why she was so emotional. She said that Brittley Metcalf kidnapped her from her home, brought her to a wooded area like this, beat her, and at some point carved his initials into her chest. Now, she wept in court as he came in there uh, this morning that a loved one held her hand throughout that process. That loved one now helping the 17-year-old fight back against the man that police say terrorized her. He is in jail on a $1 million bond, but she still wants that order of protection, a court order saying that he must avoid her for one year. She said before his arrest, he repeatedly called her, sent threatening text messages, uh, saying that there will be consequences if she didn't answer the phone, that she needed to be punished and threats to kill her. Her attorney asked for a delay to present those messages in court. The evidence that we're trying to obtain is messages off of the plaintiff's cell phone and the Cherville Police Department currently has that, but they've okay. indicated that they're planning on returning it. Now, all this could have been avoided if Metcalf simply agreed to stay away from her, from her for one year. He didn't. He wants to have an attorney present. So that meeting, that hearing is continued until the middle of next month, guys.